Hi guys, Nick Miller from Mark Supply 88. Today we have the 2007 Cub Cadet Volunteer 4x4 Utility Vehicle. This v utility vehicle is set up with a 6 foot manual angle snow blade with power lift. It has a power dump bed up and down and it's set up with a Snow X uh, mini salt spreader on the back. This unit has 611 hours on it. It does have full cabin heat. You can see inside the cab it's nice and clean. Today the purpose of this video is to show that this machine does start running work. We will run it around here, show you everything we know about it. It has power up and down for your bed, power up and down for your snow blade, heater, has 12 volt heater up here in the, in the top of the cab. Has a strobe light on the top of the cab for safety. Does have four wheel drive which you can take in and out. Has 12 volt power source for cigarette lighter. You have a fuel gauge, battery gauge, parking brake indicator, oil pressure gauge. You have a nice little cubby hole compartment down here for storing different things. This does have a Hurst shifter in it, believe it or not. High and low in reverse. Also has locking differential where you can lock it in and out. It has twin cup holders and another little tray. Seat belts. Uh, down here is your Snow X uh, salt spreader controller. Underneath your seat, of course you have your, your battery with all your electrical hookups. Underneath this seat you can see your fuel tank and clutch setup. We'll walk you around this machine. You can see it does have sliding windows in the doors and in the rear. The cab doors are nice shape. They're not all bent up or anything like that. The rubber's in nice condition. Um, you can see it does have just a, a receiver style mount. Snow X salt, salt spreader in the back. It does have normal little powder coat flake from the powder coat. But it's not rusted out or anything like that. Side plastic still in nice shape, and the paint still has a good shine to it. The cab is in very nice condition, like I said. There's a little wee bit of powder coat loss down at the door, but there's there's no rust holes or anything like that at all. It's just powder coat flake. Has a nice tip-up hood to access underneath. You can see down in the frames really nice and clean. Down your front differential, it's nice and clean down in there. Does have a windshield wiper, tinted front glass, and this does have a rubber cutting edge on your snow blade so that once you wear it, it's a double edge. You just flip it right over and re wear it again. And that is power up and down on the lift, and you can see it is four wheel drive. We have tested the four wheel drive, it all works excellent. It also has a rear view mirror in the cab. And there's normal scratches in the bed from, from it hauling different things and materials. But no rust in the bed or anything like that, no rust. The salt spreader easily comes off there in just a few seconds by simply pulling the receiver pin and unhooking the electrical connection. You can set that right aside. And you can see that the spreader inside, it's not all laid out or anything like that, but plastic's not busted up. At this time, we'll go ahead and we'll start this unit. We'll show you that the bed goes up and down, the snow plow raises up and down. We'll put it in gear, run it around the yard here and back up for you and uh, show you how it all works. The unit's powered by a Kohler, uh, 20 horsepower V-twin gas engine, electric start. Um, and you want to remove your parking brake. And it does have high and low range, which is nice for plowing snow. You can see the revolving light, strobe light on the front works nice. The 
you can see really nice how the bed really raises up nice it does dump nice and high and I'll go ahead and get you a shot in there and I'll go around the other side also and give you a little picture of the engine bay you can see right here is your Kohler engine it's uh, fairly easy to get to there's a panel here that just snaps off and removes you can get to it down here's your rear end up and underneath your bed you can see the rubber still very 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 nice it does have coil over suspension there the gas shocks now your snow blade will show you how it goes right there is down and then an actuator just runs him back up and then to angle your blade all you have to do here if you want it straight that's this position it's in now very simply just just take and angling that way by uh, just pushing him over replace your pin and there you can see in just a few seconds I've changed the angle from left to right or from straight to left and then also just pull your pin again if you want to push it to your right and drop your pin right back in nothing to it I mean it has fully adjustable skid shoes on it which you can see uh, it has four trip springs and then for transporting around you just want to have your blade straight pull your pin once again put your safety pin in and that's pretty much all you have to do and we'll put the bed back down it is power down also And then we're also going to engage the salt spreader. You simply just turn it on. It has adjustable speed control, fast and slow. So if you want to broadcast it wide or a narrow path, it'll do that. You can see that all works. You can see the revolving light on the roof works. We'll also take you inside the cab and turn the wiper on. We'll turn it well, I'll show him here. It has adjustable wiper one and one and two speed. And that all works as you can see. There's just a very simple switch up here. It has a dome light inside the cab. Also it has auxiliary right lights where it has headlights down front and headlights up on the cab. They all work. You can see the seats are in nice condition, nice interior in the cab, the heater works. We'll light that up for you. And you can see it works. It blows out nice heat. So, but everything on this cart's in decent shape. It does everything it's supposed to do. And like I said, the cab's nice. There is the key there for the cab doors also to lock it up. So, hey, if you have any questions on our Cub Cadet Volunteer four-wheel drive utility vehicle, please give us a call. We'll be glad to answer any questions you may have about it. If you'd like to come take a look at it, you're welcome to call us about that also. So call Mark or Nick at Mark Supply 88, 814-658-3066. Thank you very much and happy eBaying.